In the name of the Father, of the Son, of the Holy, Son, Spirit. Holy Amen. Spirit. Amen. Come, Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of your faithful and enkindle in them the fire of your divine love. Send forth your spirit, and they shall be created, and you shall renew the, renew the face of the earth. O God, with the light of the Holy Spirit, did instruct the hearts of the faithful. Grant us the same Holy Spirit to release what is right and just, and always to rejoice in his consolation. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. 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 A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory, Glory to you, O Lord. Lord. Jesus said to his disciples, Do not think that I have come to abolish the law or the prophets. I have come not to abolish, but to fulfill. Amen, I say to you, until heaven and earth pass away, not the smallest letter or the smallest part of a letter will pass from the law until all things have taken place. Therefore, when takes one of the least of the commandments and others to do so, will be called least in the kingdom of heaven. But whoever obeys and teaches these commandments will be called great in the kingdom of heaven. The gospel of the Lord. Praise, Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Christ. Well, it's not, not very short. Two, three verses. It's about the law. No? And it says, I did not come to abolish the law. But uh, the question is, what is the law for? No? You can just imagine a country or a, any place, city without laws. There must be chaos, you know. So the law was, are made not to restrict people, but to guide them and to put order in people's lives. And we must also consider this, that the law has a spirit, no? The spirit of the law and the letter of the law. Ito ang nakaka-confuse para sa mga Pharisees, no? Because they, they are more concerned about the letter of the law, the observance of the law to the letter. We made so many laws, hundreds, but they themselves do not do or do not obey. They put it on the shoulders of the people. God gave us the Ten Commandments, no? Just ten. And we can hardly observe all ten. Sampu lang yan eh. Hindi pa natin masunod, no? And they're not meant to restrict or to limit us, but to put order in our lives. Hmm? And the difference of the law of the Pharisees is that they put more emphasis and the observance of the law without uh, the, uh, what do you call this? Without the consideration of, uh, of how the law operates. You know? The Ten Commandments is the law of love. See? That was the spirit of the law that Jesus put in the Ten Commandments. Love, the spirit of love. And love is the fulfillment of the law. See? And it is made 
so we might find the right, right relationship with God and to fight and free us from uh, this, from sins, you see. And we are taught to fulfill the law, not to break it. So the emphasis of the law here is about the law of love. Love your enemies. Pray for your persecutors. It's really hard, but uh, the law is a law. Amen. 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 Thank you very much, um, Kito Mani. I have here a short reflection. No? Um, this is uh, from Marino Das Marinas again. Let me read to you. Let me share to you his reflection. Uh, it says here, it starts here. Do you obey, teach, and live the laws of the Lord? Jesus in our gospel for today speaks about himself as the fulfillment of the law. In effect, Jesus was telling the disciples, I am now the fulfillment of those commandments from the Old Testament. For example, the 10 commandments which God gave to Moses in the, in the mountain of Sinai, Jesus summarized these 10 to become the two, the two greatest commandments. Ang, ang 10 nagiging two, love the, love the Lord, your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your mind. This is the first and the greatest. And then the second is love your neighbor as yourself. And all the law and the prophets hang on these two commandments. So ang, ang, the, the overall um, 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 emphasis of these 10 commandments is still about love, just like what you, you said, Tito, um, Tito Man, you know, it's all about love. But first and foremost, love him, love God above all things, and then love your neighbors. Jesus summarized the 10 commandments, thus it became the two greatest commandments. Indeed, we really love Jesus. There would be no room for hatred, no room for condemnation, no room for self-righteousness, bigotry, and narrow-mindedness. What would remain in our hearts is love for love, is the advocacy and language of Jesus. Jesus is the greatest, is as the greatest symbol of love. Jesus' love for us is so unlike the love that we have. His love is unconditional. This is for the reason that Jesus' love is not a selective kind of love, but love for every one of us, no matter who we are. Unconditional talaga. This is therefore the exercise of love that we have to em emulate. To love everyone, no matter how they loved us, and no matter the sins that they have committed against us. It's all about love. And the greatest of all the commandments is really, really love. When we have love in our hearts, no? Walang self-righteousness, walang hatred, walang, walang negative, uh, ano, negative uh, emotions, wala. So if we have love, no, we have charity, we have compassion, we have unconditional love, we help each other, we will love each other, we help each other, we pray for each other. Amen. So... Love lang naman yan, hindi eh, ba? But hindi pa natin masunod. Why can't we love? It's, it's, it doesn't cost us a thing. It, does, it doesn't cost us a penny. Why, why not give away love? No. Because of hindi naman yan binibili. We don't buy it. Hindi naman yan binibili. Why, why not give it freely? No? Imagine the world, no, kung mag-follow lang ng, ng commandment na ito na love, uh, na, uh, about love and love thy neighbor and, and unconditional love, just like what Jesus' uh, um, uh, Jesus love is, unconditional. Imagine, no, there will be peace. There will be peace. World peace. 
ma-imagine natin no can, can can we imagine no masarap siguro no can we imagine a world na full of love lahat-lahat full of love full of peace full of happiness I don't know if it's possible I don't think not, so June no I don't it, think kasi we are not that perfect may mga ano eh may mga differences may mga imperfection we cannot love our enemy example Diba? Maybe, Although oh. later on, we can do it siguro, but not that. Oh, my love. Oh. If, 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 we have, if, if we have enough love, uh, if we have enough love, no? Sa, sa, in ourselves, if we have enough love, there is, no, sabi nga dito, there will be no more, no more space for hatred and anger. Very, very hard to, oh, okay. to, to attain, no? Very, very hard to achieve. It's so challenging. We will start here, just just uh, so people around us. If not people around us, start sa home natin, sa family, sa close, sa loved ones natin. Doon tayo mag, mag-start. Because they said na love, everything, everything would start in our hearts. And then, and then it is spread yan. Whatever it is, everything everything starts in our hearts. It's it's so challenging, really. But let's say a, a commandment. Eh. Kahit na kahit na ten commandments, it, it's true. Tito mani no ten ang commandments of God is ten nga lang eh. But hindi pa natin masunod. Especially ang ang love na dito ang 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 no dito gina emphasize. Dito it's dito so gina emphasize. But but what uh, as just like uh, what Father Danny said no na na about forgiveness. A number one na hindrance sa love is an unforgiveness. Eh. Unforgiveness. Uh, no. Especially especially for uh, can you love somebody? Wala dito si Tita Flor no. Can you love somebody the criminal who killed who, who killed a loved one? Mga ganyan ba? So, after ng kwan, after ng 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 um, reflection natin and and interaction kahapon uh, nag ano si Tita Flor she, he she text me like sabi na how how can you love i know what what she meant how can you love that criminal who killed her only son for no reason for no reason kaya nga eh, sabi ko uh, i not that intra- perfect It's really hard to love your enemy. Oh. Really sa, 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 sa stage in life natin, no? siguro, I, I can say na there are, there are more than one uh, people that we don't like. If we don't, if we don't really hate, but we don't like. Yes, may ara, good na. Oh, mayroon talaga. Oh. So, let's just pray for, for these challenges, no? Na it's easy to give away. It's not. It's it's free. It's it's free. It it doesn't cost us a penny. The so, bottom line is pride, you know. Exactly. Yeah, it's pride. Uh-oh. It's pride. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Still have. Uh... Please go ahead, Tito Elmer. Huh? We cannot even love the person close to us, our husband, or maybe the brothers and sisters normally don't have problems, but that's normal too. Ngayon lang, your own husband, kaya hindi mo kaya mahalin, your own wife hindi mo kaya mahalin, Unconditionally. That's, Kaya mong mahalin, pero unconditionally, mahirap. Uh-oh. But it, it's about time. Sabi mo, we are not perfect. Pero, ang sabi ni, ni Jesus, be Christ-like ang, ang pagtuturo ng simbahan. Uh-oh. So, be perfect as His Father is perfect. Ngayon, magsasabi ka pa rin, hindi ako perfect eh. No. Be perfect, sabi na. Father Dan is Father Dan is here. O nga, no? Yeah. So we welcome. We welcome Father Danny. 
Okay, don't disturb. Okay lang. Thank you. Good evening. <laughs> Tuloy lang po. <laughs> Nag-reflection na kami, Father. Yes, and, I, I wanted and recording. to. Uh, I wanted recording. to hear. Uh, we're discussing about the unconditional love, the Ten Commandments, and the priority. The top priority talaga is uh, love. Love God above all things and then love thy neighbor. It is so challenging, Father. To love thy neighbor, uh, just like uh, what Jesus uh, Jesus is uh, is teaching us. Na the, the the his love is unconditional, and right. and yeah, and and we are discussing about how can how can it's so challenging because how can you love those? Uh, for example, no, wala dito si Tita Flor. How how can she love the criminal who killed her son? so many challenges. Yes. So, and according to Tito Mani, according to Tito Mani, it's it's about the pride. Na hindi tayo maka maka love. So, so so yun father hang hanggang jan kami about about the Ten Commandments, about about the laws yeah, that we have to nice. follow. So, the laws that uh, Christ came. Not to abolish, but to fulfill. Yeah, fulfill. yeah. I think Tito Mane was going through that, uh -huh. and then there was a point that how can we do that? We are not perfect. But Jesus was telling them, "Be perfect, as my Father is perfect." So you want to follow Jesus' union. Uh, Father, you have the floor now, please. Well, you, you, are, you are all doing fine. So <laughs> nice reflections. And yeah, uh, very true, very true. But you see, the last part of the gospel today speaks of greatness. Who are those greatest in the kingdom of God? And Jesus said, those who obey the law and those who teach the law. Well, if you go to the law, that's the Ten Commandments that have been given by Yahweh in the Old Testament. So fulfilling those laws would mean really being perfect. You are perfecting yourself. But Jesus came, he said, I did not come to abolish, but to fulfill the law. And he gave us two summaries of the law. And the first is love God with all your heart, with all your mind, with all your sense, with all your soul. So the priority is God. That's why the first three commandments belong to the Lord. Going to Mass on Sunday then making it holy, not using the name of God in vain, loving God with all. So much so that when we love God with all our heart, then the fourth to ten commandments are all about loving our neighbor. And precisely the foundation is the love of God. Because when we love God, then we love ourselves as well. We love our neighbor as well. So the triumvirate would go. So it could not be that you love your neighbor, but you don't love yourself. It could not be that you love God and you hate yourself. Of course, the hating of oneself is an, in the gospel discipleship is an other than hating it for the sinfulness that we are doing, the pride that we are having, so on and so forth. So that ultimately, it would be really an encounter of the love of God. Now, our greatness lies in obeying the commandments, obeying the will of God. After all, Jesus taught us, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven, in the our Father that had been given to us. So when we obey the commandments, especially the commandment of love, the general na yan, so love, so with all our heart, that would be compassion, mercy, and everything, forgiveness. So, you know, we, we fulfill, we are greatest. And of course, we have to teach others as well. So teaching is a component of that. It could not be that we only know, but we do not teach. The teaching capacity in us is always a component towards greatness. So tonight, let us really live, love the law, fulfill it, and become as well teachers to others. Now, sabi nga kanina, I, I was sharing, of course, you know, yung situation ni Tita, pinatay yung pong anak niya. Oh, the same, Tita Flor. Yeah, Tita Flor, the same situation that Father Rene had when the brother was killed as well. Diba? It's a collective reflection of the family because not only because, madali, because they have a priest brother. So much so that he was able to inculcate forgiveness. 
So, but of course, in the human tendency, we could not forgive because we are filled with anger, we are filled with hate. And when we are filled with hate and anger, then that goes again as well to the commandment of fulfilling the commandment of the Lord of loving. The challenge of discipleship to love is really hard when we put it into practice because we have our human predicaments, we have our human situation, our own biases and judgment. But when we allow God, when we allow his forgiveness, and we truly pray that it will be done, then I know forgiveness can come as well. And definitely it becomes an experience of peace and love. Amen. 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 So let us pray, Lord. Thank you for teaching us. Thank you for Lord, teaching thank you us. For teaching us. That to be greatest, to be greatest is to obey your commandments. Is to obey your commandments. The commandment, the commandment of loving God. The commandment, the commandment of, of loving God. And loving our neighbor as we love ourselves. Loving, our, loving our, neighbor our neighbor as we love ourselves. ourselves. And to teach others as well. And to teach, to teach, to teach others, others as well. As well. The, way the way towards you. The way towards you. And the only way is the way of love. And the only way is the way of love. You have shown us the way, O oh Lord. You have shown us the way, O oh Lord. By carrying the cross to the Calvary. By carrying the cross to Calvary. The cross of our sinfulness. The cross of our sinfulness. The cross of our pride. The cross, the cross of our, our pride. biases and judgments, biases and judgments, and judgments. anger and hate at times, anger and hate at, at times, even lies, even lies, even even lies. lies. we ask for forgiveness, O Lord. We ask, we ask for, for forgiveness, Lord. 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 Lord, lead us every day. Lord, 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 that like you, that like, that like you, we like become you. doers of the will of God. We become, become doers of the will of God. God. Amen. 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 Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Saint Joseph, pray, pray for, for us. us. Saint, Saints Michael, Raphael, and Gabriel, pray, pray, pray for us. us. Angel of God, my 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 God, Saint Augustine, pray, pray, pray for us. us. Saint Anthony of Padua, pray, pray for, for us. Saint Hannibal Maria di Francia, pray, pray, pray for, for us. us. Send, O Lord, the Lord be with you. And, and with your spirit. spirit. May Almighty God bless you all, the Father and the, the Father, Son and the, and the Holy Spirit. Spirit. Amen. 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 Good evening, all. Good evening, Good Father. Evening, Father. Father. Thank, you oh. Thank you very much once again. Father. We love you, so, Father. We love, we love you all. We love you. So be great or be greatest by obeying and teaching others. Yes. Amen. Amen. <laughs> wow. Loving others. Uh, yes. <laughs> Teach others <laughs> to love. Teach others to forgive. Oh, yun, yun. Teaching yun part ng loving yun. Wow. <laughs> Not really love. Love. <laughs> Suddenly everybody was quiet. <laughs> <laughs> because that's the only way to be fulfilling the law of God. So like Jesus, I say Jesus' example, diba? Father, forgive them. They do not know what they are doing. Not know what they do. Yes. So he, he met his mother, bruised as he was. But you know, at the end, that beautiful encounter with his mother was the most touching one as well. But you know, siguro kung ikaw yung nanay nun, you wanted to say, stop na anak, don't do it na, don't carry the cross. 
But you know, he, he wanted to tell his mother, I have to do the will of God. So all of which are part and parcel. So the discipleship really is to fulfill the law and the prophet like Jesus. After all, Jesus is the fulfillment of the law and the prophets. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. We have a nice evening. Love you all. God bless. Bye bye. 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 Bye Hello. Are you going to give your reflection, Tito Mani? It's done. Tomorrow. 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 Na. <laughs> Tomorrow. <laughs> Tito Mani. <laughs> What's that today? It's not for today. It's not for today. Okay, Tito Elmer. Nauna kami, nauna kami. Late si Father dumating kasi. Late si Father. But anyway, uh, yung point uh, ni Father... Okay. The final final uh, point, my father, is the who is the greatest in the kingdom of heaven. You know, talagang that's the punchline, my father, kanina. Okay. Uh, we would like to have a short prayer, Lord. We want to be one of those who love your law. You promised to make us like you to complete to complete all of us and to bring us one day to heaven. Help us to see your law and living and living out as our part of that plan and make your will will be the passion of our lives. Just an update with you. The Our brothers right now in uh, Ukraine and Poland. In in Poland is a uh, crisis of Suba, and uh, with Ukraine uh, is uh, the bishop representing Ukraine now is Chumit Sik. And um, we would like to ask everybody to respond on the worldwide call for prayer of Pope Francis. For our brothers in Ukraine, Poland, and elsewhere right now. As everybody is moving. Again, again, the, the group and the order which have been in Ukraine for almost a decade and on the nights and a, a few years from our global uh, Prayer warrior, our presence involved both the Eastern and the Western traditions. So I would like to call that our group, the, the prayer warriors of the Rogate, will be the uniting uh, key efforts right now in uh, in Poland 
as we prepare for some of our people to move out for safety from Ukraine. Lord, by today, give us your grace that this peace in that part of the world be with us, be with this world, be with us, and as promised by Our Lady of Fatima, for the conversion of Russia and the war will stop. Yes, Mama Mary, we, pro we will pray around the rosary each day. Amen. 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 Thank you, Tito Elmer. Tita Linda, may we have the three pointers? <clears throat> the three pointers for today's gospel. Number one, when we practice our faith, we tend to be selective to disregard certain aspects as archaic, too demanding, and too moralistic, and the like. Number two, in today's gospel, Jesus assures us that he has not come to abolish the commandments, but instead has come to fulfill them and bring them to a higher spiritual level of perfection and fulfillment. Number three, do we ever challenge ourselves to go beyond what we like and dislike? and try to allow the wisdom of God and the church to guide us to the truth that Jesus preaches. Pray for the gift of openness and sincerity in the way we love God in our daily living. Amen. 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 Thank you so much, Tita Lynn. Tita Grace, may we have the prayer of peace. Okay, Paul. Okay. In the name of the Father, of the Son, the of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Spirit. Amen. Amen. Lord Jesus, we come to you in our need. Create in us awareness of the massive forces that threaten the world today and grant us the sense of urgency to activate the forces of goodness, of justice, of love, and of peace. Where there is armed conflict, let us stretch our arms to our brothers and sisters. Where there is abundance, let there be simple lifestyle and sharing. Where there is poverty, let there be dignified living and constant striving for just structure. Where there is selfish ambition, let there be humble service. Where there is despair, let there be hope in the good news. Where there are wounds of division, let there be unity and wholeness. Help us to be committed, committed to the building of your kingdom, not seeking to be cared for but to care, not expecting to be served but to place ourselves in the service of others, not aspiring to be materially secure, but to place our security in your love. Feed us your spirit, for it is only in loving imitation of you, Lord, that we can discover the healing spring of life that will bring about new birth to our earth and hope for the world. Amen. 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 Name the Father and the Son of the Holy Spirit. Name the Amen. Father and the Son of the Holy Spirit. Amen. 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 That ends our prayer meeting. Thank you so much, everybody. Thank you. And good, good morning. morning. Bye. 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 Bye.